All right, so in problem five, we have this uh, cashew problem. We got 10, uh, this company has 10% Brazil nuts, 20% cashews, 20% almonds, 10% hazelnuts, rest are peanuts. You buy a large can and separate the various kinds of nuts. Upon weighing them, you find that there are 112 grams of Brazil nuts, 183 grams of cashews, so forth and so on, all the way up to 446 grams of peanuts. You wonder whether your mix is significantly different from what the company advertises. So why isn't a chi-squared test uh, appropriate in this, in this deal? Well, the problem is that your one of your conditions is the counted data condition. And the issue you have is when you have weight, that's not in counts, that's a quantitative measure because it has units. So you can't apply a chi-squared to a quantitative situation. So in this case, we could not use a chi-squared uh, to, uh, to test the, the uh, number of grams of the nuts. Okay, We'd have to use a different test. So that would not be appropriate here. And then question B says, what might you do instead of weighing the nuts? Well, you could count them. You know, you'd have to count them. But the problem is when they get those percentages in the beginning, you don't know, are those percentages by weight or are those percentages by counts? So it's unclear what those percentages mean. So in this particular problem, we would need a little bit more information to proceed.